In this lesson, we're going to take a look at how to control the visibility of work features, specifically how to turn them on and turn them off. The easiest way is in the graphics window, just move your cursor over one of the edges, then click visibility from the menu. You see it works for work axes as well as work planes. Let me undo that, bring both of those back. I can also go in the browser, right click, here, let's bring that browser to the top so we can see it a little bit better. Move my cursor back over that. Right click and visibility. Turn that off. Again, so if there's a whole bunch of these I want to turn on and off, I could hold down the control key, select them as well. But that's pretty much the same process. A better method may be to go under the view pull down and under object visibility, we can turn off the visibility of selected features. So in this case, I can say I want to turn off all the user work planes. And you'll notice that there are some existing planes that are still on. Well, in this case, if I expand the origin folder, these are the origin planes. So let me undo that, bring them all back. And again, go under the, the view pull down and under object visibility, I could just turn off the origin planes if I wanted to. Again, I'll undo that. But if I want to turn off everything, I can simply click on all work features and everything will disappear. Now, just the opposite is true. If I want to turn back on a certain set, again, go under the view, object visibility. And in this case, let's just turn on our user work axes. And you'll see that both my work axes are now visible.